scooter's registered name is Belcourt's Cool Dude. And Scooter being his call name, um, his titles are he is a Grand Master Obedience Trial Champion and an American Obedience Trial Champion and a liquor. <laughs> he just won the number one obedience dog in Canada for this year. At two years old, he wasn't ready to do anything, but by three, he was starting to look like he could be a competition dog. And so he started novice about three and a half, and then went through to open and then through to utility very quickly. There's just something about when a dog gets it, what you're trying to get them to do, and, and they understand it, that moment when the light bulb comes on and they've got it, that's pretty cool. It's also pretty cool to have a hobby that's lasted. You added the years up. I don't add them up anymore. I lie about it all the time. Oh, I've been in it 30 odd years, <laughs> or 30-ish. To teach another species to understand your language and work with you as a team, because they really have to be a team. When you go in the ring, the leash comes off, there's no cookies or anything, it's you and your dog. I mean, at that point, the dog can say or do whatever the dog wants. But to make that commitment to train the dog to totally listen and be devoted, this is his favorite place to be, sitting on the couch with me. So uh, to teach him to go in the ring and work as hard as he works, and he does work hard. When you go to a dog show, it's like kids, I guess, that practice dancing and stuff for weeks and weeks to go and do a concert. Suddenly we're at the concert and he just comes alive. It's like, yeah, dog shows. So uh, he's quite a showman himself.